Hello and welcome to my podcast. My name is Nayeli Lopez and today I'll be informing you of all about cyberbullying. I'll be answering some questions that are critical to know about cyberbullying. But first, what is cyberbullying? Cyberbullying is whenever somebody is being told hurtful things digitally. The only main thing that separates it from bullying is that cyberbullying is done online. Something you should always ask yourself when you're talking to someone online is, is what I'm saying in any way possibly hurting the other person's feelings? Does cyberbullying have the same impact as bullying would? Cyberbullying has the same impact that normal bullying does because they can both have a huge impact on somebody. What do I do if I see somebody getting cyberbullied? If you see somebody getting cyberbullied, you shouldn't just be a bystander. You should stand up for them because maybe they're too scared to stand up for themselves or they can't. Because if everyone stands up against the bully, he or she begins to feel powerless, guilty, and then apologizes. And the bullying completely stops. What do I do if I'm getting cyberbullied? If you're getting cyberbullied, it's important to remember that what the bullies are doing is wrong. So it's important to never respond negatively right away. You should take a screenshot of your evidence that you're getting cyberbullied. And then you should tell an adult you trust, your parents, or even your guidance counselor. What are the effects of cyberbullying? Effects of cyberbullying include depression, a decrease in one's self-esteem. They can even drop out of school if the cyberbullying gets out of hand. Some people have even resorted to becoming suicidal and they lost their life because of cyberbullying. Another thing about cyberbullying is that whenever somebody's sending a message online, they might have no idea how hurtful the message may be. What are the consequences of cyberbullying? Cyberbullying is certainly not right, and it's also illegal in some states in America, which is another reason why it's important to watch what you're saying online, because it could end up being disrespectful and hurting the other person's feelings. Well, that's all for today's podcast. I hope I was able to teach you something about cyberbullying. And remember to never cyberbully and to always be kind and appropriate whenever you're online. Thank you for watching my podcast. See you next time.